channel. I hope that you guys are doing absolutely great. Y'all, let's go ahead and jump into this message. We're going to go ahead and do a short and sweet. So let's jump into this message. I hope you guys are doing absolutely great. All right. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Angels. Most High Heavenly Father, what is the message for your viewers, for the collective at this time? What is the message? What is the message? I hope you guys have been being gentle with yourselves as you guys are bringing certain chapters of your lives to a close. As you guys are finalizing things or putting a finishing touch on something, I hope that you guys are being gentle with yourselves as you do so. Um, I know that the collective right now um, are wrapping up cycles, okay? Especially as we are entering into this blue full moon. Um, you guys are definitely being called to close out things. You, you have been called to close out things. Um, hopefully you guys are doing that. Hopefully you guys are wrapping up those cycles and closing out um, closing doors that need to be closed in your lives. Okay. Um, I feel like each of us are doing that on some level. Okay. All right. So good luck to you guys as you guys are doing that. Wow. The ace of swords, truth and clarity, truth and clarity. Okay. So I feel like that is definitely what you all are doing. The Ace of Wands in here is here. I feel like you guys are doing this just in time for this fresh start or this new beginning to occur. Okay, now there's some people um, that may be left in regret, the ones that haven't closed the doors, the ones that didn't uh, respond or listen to their nudges, okay, to close the doors, to end that chapter, to bring those certain things to a close, okay, whatever it is in people's lives that they were called to do not everybody had the courage to do that not everybody um took action when they were called to close these doors and so we do have some people that are going to be in regret or feeling remorseful this full moon that they did not close out these doors close out these chap chapters okay because what is here for you is justice okay so you have justice wanting to come through so long as you did follow those um, guidelines, okay? So long as you did listen to your spirit, so long as you did listen to God when you were guided to close that chapter, um, finalize that thing, put the finishing touches on something, okay? It's like, if you did it, I just keep getting this vibe. Even for myself, I'm like, man, there's something that I did and I did it just in time for this full moon cycle. I can't exactly tell y'all why. All I can do is tell you that is an, it is a frequency. It is an air. It is in the air, right? That there is a thing that we're supposed to close out just in time for this full moon, okay? And I did get the vibe that if, if people didn't, then they're not going to reap some form of benefit that's coming with closing out this cycle prior to this full moon, okay? All right. Yeah, the Ace of Cups. Because what you guys are receiving is some type of support, right? This is like universal support that's trying to come through for us, okay? With the Ace of Cups. This chapter involved you honoring some form of duty that you had to yourself, okay? 344 on the clock as I said that. Three Aces are out here so far paired with the Justice. This is big energy, this isn't small energy that's moving around right now, okay? This is big energy, the Six of Pentacles. This is life restoring, life renewing, life changing energy, all right, with the Six of Pentacles. Whenever this Six of Pentacles card comes out in this deck, this speaks about the Scarab Beetle, which then speaks about a restoration of life. Okay, the scarab beetle holding the sun in particular. Some of you guys could have seen this symbol. Some of you guys could wear this symbol as an amulet, okay? Um, or you just know when you see this that that's what that means, okay? So there is some, for those of you guys that have Egyptian blood or, or royal blood or blood background, okay? Bloodlines or backgrounds, all right? Heritage, all right? Okay. So that's the thing, definitely. You guys were guided. Definitely you guys were called, okay? And it's because with the emperor here, you guys are about to boss up your energy, right? Now, we talked about that. Y'all are bossing up your life, okay? Y'all's lives are bossing up right now, okay? We have the king of pentacles. This did come out in the reverse. The king of pentacles reversed. 
okay an earth sign could be off balance all right or or something's not right with someone's money maybe you guys are oh well it's like that's going to be turning around the ten of pentacles okay so if you felt unbalanced financially or your abundance you felt like was was not it was it wasn't in the upright like it wasn't i feel like you could have felt like your finances wasn't getting to you or like as soon as you was getting it it was being spent out okay um you guys could have felt like you were on burnout or something like that hold on yeah there could just be a vibe right where you guys could have just felt like okay something was off balance here energetically okay um financially things were out of whack or out of balance or things just wasn't wasn't adding up but there's some type of of change coming with that your finances i feel like this is like illustrating that your finances are going to turn around with the king of pentacles in the reverse to the ten of pentacles okay your finances are going to be turning around here I feel like this is going to have your emotions, um, emotions like could be running high right now. Okay. Emotions could be running high. The energy, you could be sensing a lot in the energy right now, especially my impasse. You guys could be feeling this shift taking place. What is this spirit? Give it to me clear. What's going on here? Someone could have felt like they weren't grounded or like the seeds they were planting were not um, blossoming. But this is a season where that's about to turn around. Yeah, we're not doing that. I am royalty. Okay, so it's like your seeds are about to blossom because I am also getting this. Some of y'all done planted a seed with this kind of King of Pentacles in the reverse, right? This is like like the way I'm getting it right now is like y'all put y'all built something from the ground up. Okay, and now it's blossoming, okay, with this caught energy. It's a vibe here where it was planted in the ground, a seed you plant in the ground, right? King of Pentacles in the reverse. You put it in the ground. You put somebody could have put some did somebody bury some money? Okay, but anyway, I don't know what that's about. But anyway, um, yeah, you planted a seed here, right? And it's like the seeds that you guys had planted with the King of Pentacles in the reverse. They're sprouting now, okay? They're gonna, you're going to start to see um, life coming up out of the ground, okay? Um, signs of life, okay? <laughs> um, if someone's health is not in the best of conditions, you're going to start to see someone's health that was taking a turn for the worse. You're going to start to see their health um, turn around, okay? You're going to see signs of life. I feel like that'll be the title of this reading, Signs of Life, short and sweet. Okay? Yeah. Because for you, some this this energy of things being off balance or you financially being off balance or your finances not making their way to you, okay? Um, oh my God. Someone was burning holes in your pockets, okay? Um, now usually they say money is burning a hole in your pockets. So you could have had some money that you were anxious to spend or something like that. Um, but what I'm really getting here is that someone, like, somebody did something, okay? I know, I'm a Libra moon. I'm going to catch it every time. <laughs> somebody tried to burn some holes in your pockets, okay? Someone could have did that, like, some type of magic, a spell involving burning holes in your pockets so that any money you would receive would fall right out or you would lose it or it would spin very rapidly, Okay. I feel like that spell is this is what we're not doing okay this is what's this is what we're not doing okay i feel like somehow here spirit is going to be confirming that this is what we're not doing okay that energy if that if someone did a spell like that this is not for every that that part won't be for everybody but if somebody did that to you um that's being canceled okay yeah you defeated that with the seven of wands okay wow so somebody wanted you to lose money just as fast as you were making it, that's turning around, okay? I'm just hearing that spell is canceled and deleted. And the energy used to create it is transformed. Okay, I just heard that. So you guys are transforming this energy, all right? The Eight of Cups, all right? You guys are moving forward. You guys are going to be going after your wish fulfillment here, all right? I'm speaking to some royalty, some royalty, I'm hearing royal tea party, okay? 
All right, Holy Spirit. Thank you for clearing and accurate messages. The death card. The death card. Yeah, it's over with. It's over with. A water sign could have did this spell. Doesn't have to be. Okay? Oh, you could be the water sign that this spell was done to. All right? Take it as it resonates. Scorpio energy, very significant. Okay? But that's coming to an end. There's about to be some type of disaster here. I don't know what exactly. Yeah, the King of Cups. Oh, I don't like this energy that I'm seeing right up in here. Okay, there is a literal passing. Someone's going to pass away. The King of Cups. Okay. With the death card, the King of Cups. Someone's father. This or someone's. I don't like that energy right there. My condolences. Whoever that is, whatever that is, my condolences. Y'all, we still dealing with the Nats. Okay? We still dealing with the Nats. Sorry, y'all, and I missed it. But sorry, you guys. Whew, I'm so sick of these Nats. They need to check the people that lived, lived that moved out. Somebody somebody could be moving out, okay? Um, but anyway, yeah, they need to they need to check that 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 house because um something going on, okay? Something going on. Okay, but anyway, yes. My condolences, whatever this is I'm seeing about this water sign, okay? Now, this could be like an ego, ego death as well, all right? But there is a literal, I am seeing a literal death as well. There's a literal passing. Someone's going to pass away, okay? All right, what else, angels, spirit guys, most high? Yeah, you're leveling up. Oh, God is highlighting your level up too, He's going to be putting this on blast, like on loudspeaker. He's going to be announcing this or something significant about someone, okay, a creator, um, an influencer, all right, or something like that, okay? He's about to highlight someone's success here with the emperor. Somebody is leveling up. Someone's gained a new crown as well, okay? I saw that the other day while I was taking a shower. Somebody has gained a new crown. Wow. Confirmation for what I'm about to say. Okay, and you guys are going to be receiving some form of abundance from the universe here. You guys are highly supported. Okay, highly, highly supported. Um, somebody here, you're highly supported by the Galactic Federation. Okay. All right. Or law enforcement. All right. I don't know. I don't. Mm, that's some. Maybe somebody. Oh goodness gracious. Okay, so excuse me because I just got confirmation for what I'm about to say. Um, there's a member in law enforcement that's gonna be passing away. Someone's father could have served. This could be in the law enforcement, or this could be in the military or the army, the reserve, something like that. Navy. I don't know. Some of them boys. Okay. Um, my condolences. Okay. Okay. What else, Holy Spirit? The lovers. Okay, the lovers. Or this could just be you ending a situation. Maybe you were in a relationship with someone who served in the in the service. All right. The lovers. I feel like somebody, somebody, somebody had it all messed up. Like, okay, they could have been talking to you all wrong. Like somebody, it's the energy here where somebody had you energetically. I don't have another word to put there, but somebody had you energetically effed up, okay? That energy is being cleared as well. Temperance and the five of pentacles. So that energy is being cleared as well. You guys are leaving someone out in the cold here. I see that. Someone could be choosing an earth angel and leaving someone else out in the cold. All right, the Six of Wands is here. So you guys are receiving some form of a victory. And this, everything that I said here is the message. Okay. You guys are, I'm speaking to some overcomers. I'm speaking to some people that have had the strength to endure. I'm speaking to somebody that has climbed all them hills and, and cleared them hurdles and just really taken back power over their life here. Okay. And you did it. You have a strength about you because you did it and it wasn't easy. All right. Oh, okay. We have the five of wands. 
Yeah, y'all have had to fight. Y'all have had to fight, okay? Y'all have had to fight for this new beginning. Yes, you have. Y'all had to lay them burdens down, okay? <laughs> the four of swords, yes. But you've recovered. You've recovered. So just think, all of that momentum you used to fight, right, for yourself, for what you deserve, okay? It's like there's an energy that's fighting just as hard that's going to be fighting for your level up. So y'all thought y'all had a lot of momentum when you guys were fighting and you guys were trying to overcome these challenges and these obstacles, but it's like you guys have that much more energy. The energy is about to be mashed here. So all of that effort and intention that you guys put in bettering yourselves and overcoming and being better and, and still standing and not giving up and not backing down and pushing through and, and financial struggles and all it's like all of that energy is about to be matched that's what i'm getting that's what's about to happen with this full moon all of the energy y'all have been putting out this energy is about to be matched okay so if this energy is being matched this lets me know that either you guys have some whoever i'm speaking to because i'm not reading for the karmics right now this is for the this is for the chosen so there's a vibe here where Whoever you guys, whatever energy you guys have been putting out, it's about to be returned to you. The energy is about to be matched. So if y'all did go hard in the paint for something that y'all were trying to bring in for, to fruition for yourselves or some type of um, goal you guys were trying to accomplish or you guys had to really, really fight to break these, these energetic, these spiritual cords or these karmic ties and things like that. Y'all, that energy is about to be met. It's about to be matched. Okay with this full moon that means y'all got some really really good things coming to y'all and it actually may come easier than it did like this the struggle was real right for you guys to get where y'all are y'all have had to be patient you guys have had to endure you guys have had all kind of stuff right but it's a vibe where like on the flip side of this mirroring energy that i'm seeing it's like it's not going to be as hard it's like there's an ease of motion. There's an ease of energy. There's a let up here. We have judgment out here. Judgment is out here. Okay. Okay. What is this judgment about? What is this judgment about, Holy Spirit? I'm so proud of y'all. Y'all really have been hard for y'all. So I know that. I can see it. I feel it. Okay. Y'all ancestors is telling me it in my ears. The Eight of Swords. Okay. The King, the Queen of Cups and the Moon. Oh, so these people, judgment is here for anybody that was behind the scenes. Okay. Trying to cause some type of confusion. Trying to um, cause illusion or spread fear. Okay. <clears throat> Or doing some type of spells. Somebody could have been trying to keep you stuck. Causing illusions. Judgment is here for that energy. I feel like this karmic energy. That's a karmic energy. Anybody sitting here sending you spell work, sending you the evil eye, wishing death upon you, speaking ill on your name. Karma is so... It's happening so fast right now. It's rapid, okay? The Chariot, the Nine of Pentacles, and the Page of Wands as the overall message here. Expect to receive some type of new energy, okay? New communication, new motivation, new energy, all right? At the bottom of the deck, we have the Seven of Pentacles. Yeah, and it's for these seeds. Okay, so these seeds that y'all that planted here. Also, for any any delays, somebody that had somebody could have been a karma could have been trying to cause you some type of delays or slowdowns. They're receiving karma for this. You guys are receiving. Mm, okay, so you guys are receiving a victory for claiming your independence here. You guys are being rewarded for claiming your independence just in time for this new this uh, full moon. Okay, that's what it is. Thank you, confirmation, spiritual belch. Because y'all, the moon is here. So here's this full moon. As I'm speaking about this moon energy, 
y'all have gotten a victory just in time because you you guys you guys were able to clear this energy just in time so let me snap it up for y'all because y'all could have delayed it y'all could have waited you guys could have put it on hold you could have been like nah not right now you could have just not made the decision to clear the energy you could have just stayed tied to something that wasn't for you okay Somebody, somebody, somebody stayed tied to a water sign that they were called to let go of. Okay. I'm seeing that or a water sign was called to let go of someone or a water sign. Somebody was called to let go of you. Okay. They're receiving judgment for this. Somebody was supposed to be letting go of your energy and they didn't. Oh, they getting, they experiencing some form of loss. Your ancestors is, is. With the seven of, oh, y'all are leveling up out of these damn delays, too. Yes. And back to the six of pentacles. Y'all being restored. So this is the message. Definitely the message. Right? You guys are leveling up, up out of this seven of pentacles, which is delays, obstacles, slowdowns. Right? But it also speaks about planting seeds and nurturing the thing. Right? So, but you guys are leveling up here. You're being restored with the six of pentacles. So everything I already said about this energy. Right? About this scarab beetle holding the sun. Y'all go look up the meaning so you guys will know that I'm not BSing you here, okay? Yeah, something could have took a long time. It could have took a long time for things to smooth out for you. But finally, they have. They have smoothed out. And it's due to your discernment. It's due to your ability to listen to your intuition when you were called to cut the damn cord, to release that thing, person, place, whatever it was. All right? Okay, let's get a short and sweet on it. Yeah, y'all claimed y'all independence just in time for this this new, this um, full moon. And not only just in time for this full moon, but just in time for the arrival of Virgo energy, right? Which first we're going to be faced with the energy of Pisces. So get ready to be under some Piscean energy as we embrace and welcome in Virgo season. All right, Holy Spirit. Short and sweet for this week. Thank you for clarity. All bark and no bite. Okay, something was ineffective. Okay, it was ineffective. Or somebody's somebody's bark was louder than their bite. Okay, someone wasn't as powerful as they thought. Okay, time transcends illusion. Okay, so I feel like someone has definitely lost their control because you took your power back. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed this read. My loves, and I will see you guys in the next one. Have a great day. Bye.